Hello friends and welcome to module 5 of the Ed325 Children's Lit class. Today we're going to talk about global and multicultural literature. So the first thing you'll want to do of course is download the response document, which I have here. And we'll review the section in the textbook that talks about that, pages 23 to 30 because they do an excellent job discussing this, so I thought that might be a good place to start. And then you're going to watch a video about the sandwich swap. The link is posted here. It's also posted here online. And it's fun because it's a collaborative reading of different children reading it, so that's a fun thing to see, and you might have something like that for your kids to do. So you're going to categorize the book, and then you're going to read this article about it, Drawing the Lines in the Sandwich, and reflect on that a little bit as it guides you here. And then what I'd like you to do is look for some good sources and titles of the four types of different kinds of multi multicultural or diverse literature representing diverse populations that the textbook highlights. Those of a global basis of parallel culture, exceptionalities, and sexual transgender. And I've given you some links here. You're not stuck to these, but I want you to find something besides Amazon so you have some other places to go for look for books. So include the APA reference to the book here, an image, a little synopsis and grade level required, recommended, and the link where you actually found the book. And then what I'd like you to do is write an ABCD objective for one of the books from each category and I'm going to review that in a little bit. For this week, you're going to read a multicultural global literature book in your discussion group, so I copied and pasted here what your book is for this week, depending on what group you're in. And then finally, I posted some articles here on diversity in children's um, books, and each person in the group, there are four articles posted, so each person's gonna read a different article and post a response to the article on the blog here. So you will write the APA reference for the article, which is a little bit different than writing a reference for a book. You will then answer these three questions on your group wiki, and then um, including a little summary of the article so the other people who haven't read it will get a sense of what your article is about. So everybody's going to read a summary of each other's articles and then response to these questions. If there's only three of you in the group, then you only need to pick three of the articles. You guys can decide which three you read and just leave one unread. So you'll post that in the Module 5 group wikis. There's one for each of your groups. And then I'm going to talk about lesson objectives and APA formatting. I think I'll do that in a separate um, video so it won't be quite so long. So that's it for the overview, but I have information here on APA format. Coming next.